video is going to demonstrate envelope fades and curves with both MIDI and audio. So first off, I have this MIDI track automated uh, in Silent to automate the cutoff. So I just put in some points and you know normally in Ableton what you do is just drop in points. If I wanted to have a slight curve you would just do something like that and have it come up. But now what you can do with new Ableton Live 9 is if you hold down Alt this little curve pops up next to your mouse and you can now drag it. So instead of having to put a dozen little dots to get a curve, you can just put two dots and then create the curve by holding Alt. Another great use for this is when you're automating white noise like fade ins and fade outs. The goal is to get it to sound more natural. The next thing I'm going to show you are audio fades. Here I have an audio track. If you go over to the side, click on fades. It will allow you to drag this dot to fade in or out of the audio track. Because I have this audio track looped, it only lets me start and finish the fades at the beginning and end of the loop. It stops me here because this is where the loop starts. Now I'm going to use Command J to consolidate the track. And this will allow me to drag the fades across the entire audio track. Now I'm using it on a snare, but that's not a really practical use. You could use it on maybe the end of your track if you're just trying to have a nice fade out to silence. I hope this video helped. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below.